how to talk with your cat about online predators. I could not be making this up even if I wanted to, fam. I just ran into a school of nits. So I just came into my office. I have a tummy ache. I'm not in the greatest mood to film, but I do want to film. And I ran into this book. I also want to do my makeup, so that's what's gonna happen. And I have a few new drugstore products I want to try out, and that's basically the gist of it. So take a seat. Take a seat right over there. How to talk with your cat. Oh, sir. I love my job. Table of contents. <laughs> Is it necessary to talk with your cat about online Predation? Is your cat a sexual predator? Scottish Folds? Encrypted technology? A questionable Netflix history? Withdrawal from a dating scene? Maintaining irregular hours? Uh, nudes? Catnips? Cat... Catnip as it relates to online predator. Is your cat giving out too much personal information? I'm gonna use this doll face blurring stick just because it's here. Also, I'm just gonna tell you guys right now, don't treat this like a tutorial or a review. Treat this as what it is, a f***ing treat. Is it necessary to talk with your cat about online predation? <laughs> I thought that was a typo. It's real. Is your cat a sexual predator? I know what you're thinking. My cat, a sexual predator? Not possible. Sadly, my friend, it is possible. No one wants to think that their feline is responsible for such heinous crimes, dick wolf. I improvised that, that's not in there. Yet new kittens are victimized every day. Fear not, as we have identified the five major warning signs that your cat may be. A sexual predator. Scottish folds. Scott did what? Catterbrain hates to dis disparage a particular breed, and it would be irresponsible not to repeat that information here. This isn't in the book, but I have these new CoverGirl items I really want to test out, and this lip glow. So hope my cat's not molesting those things. For foundation, I'm just gonna go ahead and use uh, this one. A questionable Netflix history. Before the internet, curious felines had to rely on blurry cable channels to catch a glimpse of some erotic programming. Are you f kidding me? As more owners have cut the cord and adopted for streaming services such as Netflix, cats have more and more options to satisfy their curiosity. A careful review of your cat's K K Q K. Oh? can provide an early warning sign that he or she is moving past mere curiosity and into the dark world of online predation. Per... Per... Predate... Predating. New online dating sites are constantly emerging and more dating apps are gaining popularity. It is possible that your cat disabled its meowmatch.com because it's too busy swiping other felines on the Tinder app. Kinder app. But it has completely abandoned the online dating scene in the prime of its nine lives. There is a good chance it has found a more devious way to satisfy its desirees. This is a bronzer. Maintaining irregular hours. The final and perhaps most difficult sign to identify is the maintaining of irregular hours. As all owners are aware, our feline friends do not embrace a standard human schedule. But even cats have an internal clock. If your feline no longer maintains any wake, walk, waking hours while you are in the home, you should be concerned. Why does your cat need so much unsupervised time awake? By now, you should know. And I'm seven years old, can you send me a piñata? A piñata? Yeah, and I'm seven years old. As long as you're not sending nudes. Nudes? What's nudes? Go, go out, go, go play with toys. Humans are not the only species that have been swept up in the nude photography phenomenon. 72% of cats in dating relationships have, on at least one occasion, sent their partner an explicit photograph 23% have sent an explicit video. Nudes happen. There is simply no avoiding it. 
In order to maintain a harmonious relationship with your four-legged friend, child, you should be giving him or her some space. That privacy should, to some degree, be extended to your cat's electronic life. As every parent knows, absolute privacy corrupts absolutely. Privacy corrupts absolutely. Should you pour over all of your cat's electronic records? Who wants to look at that many pictures of vulnerable tuna and bird murder? Not I said the cat. <gasps> I feel like we skipped some. Uh -huh. Hey babe, do you think that Zelda is suffering from a withdrawal from the dating scene? Maybe. Maintaining irregular hours? Oh, she's been pretty crazy all the time. We need to talk to our cat about online predators. Otoño, hmm. I think we need to talk to your sister. Like what sister? Zelda! She's not my sister! How dare you? About what? Online predators. Wait, what's that? I guess we need to talk to you too. Babe, do you think Autumn has been keeping irregular hours? Yeah. Uh-oh. Honestly, I want to be the parent that's like my little Zelda. Never. She is so calm. She is so perfect. She's angelic. She would never, ever, ever. But at the same time, I know my Zelda. And she's a little slower sometimes. I mean, I love her. I love her very much. She's just very free with her body. She just tends to put it all out there, you know? She doesn't have walks of shames, okay? She has proud whole strolls. She doesn't ask permission. She also doesn't ask for forgiveness. I've given her the carrot. I've also given her the stick, but so have many other cats is all, it's just a lot. What would Kim do? She would make a sex tape. Oh God. Methods of transfer. Certain mediums were designed to send nudes. Your cat should consider how they will share their nudes. Snapchat was made for nudes, but remember that screenshots are a thing. There are multiple encrypted messaging platforms that can help prevent the images from being intercepted. Additionally, regardless of the transmission method, remind your cat to triple check the addressee information before hitting send. There are no takesy backsies once the nude has been pushed out to its a other. Stills or videos. This is the pixie from head to toe highlighter. Uh, this is from the PR opening I had back a couple weeks ago when I felt my cat was safe. This might be a little too dark for me. Like the world? It's really pretty. This is really pretty. Good job, Pixie and from head to toe. Is one nude the same as 10? Like all vices, sending one nude can often lead to more. It is easy for cats to forget that every nude is still an image that should be reserved for someone special. Whether it is the first nude or the hundredth, remind your cat that every nude is still a nude. And as they think about before they send it, predators are much more likely to share collections of one cat's nudes than a sampling of multiple cats nude. Consequently, the fewer images your feline shares, the less likely they are to be leaked. I meant to use this one, but that's really pretty. Substance abuse is a danger lurking around every corner for the domesticated cat. Recreational activities in moderation can add much needed relief in anyone's life. But when leisure turns to abuse, faculties, I'm sorry, pussy's on the mind, I'm sorry. When leisure turns to abuse, one's faculties of reason and judgment become disoriented and right and wrong can easily become blurred. A once cuddly and adoring feline companion can silently be longing for his or her next fix. Jesus Christ. Fake Facebook accounts opened by humans will often depict their cats in ways humorous to the human yet potentially damaging to their feline counterpart. We have personally witnessed dozens of users who have unintentionally posted explicit pictures of their cats online. These pictures can spread across the internet like wildfire. A little too real, but okay. Unfortunately, the dressing of cats into the humorous frogs has greatly contributed to this form of identity theft. When a cat's face is obscured, geared with colorful sunglasses, an oversized bow tie, or a cute miniature hat. The true identity of a specific cat can be difficult to determine. For this reason, it is immensely important to recognize when your cat is giving out too much information online. Of a thousand cats surveyed, Catsumer reports suggested that 75% of cats frequently give out the location of their home and their location inside the home. 
At various times throughout the day, common locations shared include hidden from human sight beneath the sofa in the lower cupboards containing a mystery smell on a window still bathed in sunlight or directly on top of the face of the human reclining in bed. While the use of laser pointers or loud noises may often scare assailants back into their dens, we can never be too careful with our beloved feline friends. For these reasons, it should remain a priority for owners to speak with their cat about how much is too much with regard to giving out personal information while online. Here at Catterbrain, we will continue to remain dedicated to raising awareness of the most pressing issues facing our feline friends. Stay safe. Till next time. Well, I thought the eyeshadow was good.